Hey guys, this is Joshua at Terra Firma 369. This is my Nyon 3 alcohol stove on a low setting. I use this for things like simmering, baking. Uh, today, I'm actually going to use the origami oven that's used for baking that Tinny sells at, uh, at uh, miniboldesign.com. However, mine is just, I made it myself out of aluminum. Uh, a little different than his, but that's because I can't get the same quality aluminum he can. But I'm about to bake some banana nut bread. Simply add water. And I have, and I'm going to put this oven on top of my stove here. Make some banana nut bread. And uh, I'm using three tiles, one on top, two inside, instead of the stones inside that Tinny uses, plus a piece of reflectix up top here, along with two or three layers of aluminum, heavy-duty aluminum foil as the top. I just found that it holds in the heat better, and especially when you're out in the field, you want to keep that heat in. It doesn't work so well when the temperatures are like, you know, 50 degrees outside, and you're trying to keep all that heat inside of this little box. So I use the Reflectix. Today I just happen to have three six-inch ceramic tiles, which would work perfect for this. And I think that the two on the inside may distribute heat better than just stones. So it's just an experiment, see what works. I don't expect to be able to keep ceramic tiles whole out in the woods. I'm just seeing what works the best and most efficiently. Anyway, as you can see, the stove is now up to a pretty decent uh, double flame, but it's not as high as the last video that I made, if you notice. Uh, it works better for baking. So anyway, I'm going to put this on here, and then i got about a half hour to 40 minutes. Bake time. There we go. I may even expand that uh, windscreen out a little bit to let it run a little cooler. But as you can see, it kicks. And to be able to bake stuff in the woods, guys, trust me from my recent trip to the Westfield, it is a luxury that brings you so much joy. Peace. Everybody be safe.